Thank you for watching our videos on Small Guy on Top. All of our videos are designed with you in mind. You're an entrepreneur, or you're a small business owner, or you run a business all by yourself, or you are a stale SME looking for help, or you're a struggling artist launching your career. These videos are for all of you. I hope you learned a lot from our videos and that you will go to our site at smallguyontop.com for articles and downloadable materials. Sign up for our newsletter while you're there to receive great ideas and tips in your inbox. All of your information that you share with us is always kept private. You can read about our privacy policy on our website at smallguyontop.com. Don't forget to whitelist our domain so that emails are delivered to the inbox by your mail provider. Also, please subscribe to our channels on YouTube and Daily Motion to keep up with the latest videos to help you with your business success. Here's how you install your CRM using cPanel. Open your cPanel and at the top type in soft and as soon as you do that you've got two elements that show up site software and softaculous. Now this assumes that you've got softaculous added to your cPanel not every cPanel has it, but most hosts will have it included. If not, it's uh, very cheap. It's like a dollar a month, something like this. You can sign up. It's a Softaculous, and uh, it'll tell you how to install it on your cPanel. So once you have it here, click on Softaculous Apps Installer. And then it'll show you any installations you've got already outdated installations and backups. So outdated means that they need to be updated. It doesn't tell you what they are until you actually click this and open it. We're not interested in that. What we want to find is our CRM, which is Sweet CRM. So I know what it is, so I can type it in right here in the search. Type in S-U-I-T. There it is. Let's click on that. And now this is going to show you a screenshot of what it looks like once you've got it installed and all we're interested in is install now. It's going to give us an option of the secured or the insecured and with www or without. So we're going to let it mine it in my case with small guy on top it's HTTPS with no www. I never add www. So then the directory name and don't use forward slashes at all unless you're putting it inside as a subdirectory in something else. I wouldn't recommend it. Just choose some sort of name. We can call it Sweet CRM or CRM, whatever you want. Then we're going to scroll down and we're going to give the site a site name. So I'm going to call it Small Guy on Top CRM. Type in your admin username that you want to use. I would recommend changing this from admin to something else. And then put in your password. You definitely want to change that. Now here, this will generate a random password for you. The problem is you've got to make sure that you've got that saved somewhere so you can find it again in case you need it. So that means it's going to be written somewhere on your computer or on a piece of paper and that means that you'll have weakened security because someone can find it. So I'd recommend going ahead and coming up with a password on your own and typing that in. Okay? And so you just go ahead and type in your password. I'm going to create a random password and I'm going to copy that to a text file just for now for what we're doing. And so I've copied it to a text file. And I'm just going to leave it there. I don't need to save it because it's only for this session. So now you can put in the name of this person if you want to change your name. So you can put your own name in here as the admin username. And then you can put your first name, your last name, and your email address. Don't hit install. Open up advanced options. I do this with every one of my installations from Softaculous, and this is very important. Choose once a day for automated backups and seven days. So it keeps one week 
of backups. And this will back up both your database and your files. It won't take up a lot of room because it only keeps seven backups. Um, it's important because the database, I'm always forgetting to back up my databases. And this makes a backup of it so you can, re you can restore from this. Hit install. Okay, so it's done. You can see, congratulations, the software was installed successfully. You've got two links here. <clears throat> now with CRM, it doesn't, in Sweet CRM, it doesn't matter, they're the same thing. They'll go to the same location, which is your login screen. So you can go ahead and click on either one of those, and that'll take you to the Sweet CRM login screen. Now you've got to have your credentials with you to sign in, obviously. In this case, I've got admin but this is a different admin password. So let me go ahead and put in that random one. And we're in. That's you, how you install your Sweet CRM. We'll have another video on how to actually set it up for a small business, and then another video on how to use it in an actual campaign.